FYI's Philly website and Facebook page. And once the calendar says August, you know, the kids will be back in school before you know it. I think she's celebrating. So Gina Gaddon turned to our friends <laughs> at Alessi Foods and Redner's Markets for some family-friendly recipes. We're talking pizza. With it being back to school season, there's nothing easier than pizza. Our first recipe is a garlicky pesto flatbread with tomatoes and arugula. Delicious and nutritious. Start by brushing a whole grain flatbread with garlic puree. Put the flatbreads in the oven to crisp them up a little bit. Next, spread each pie with pesto. This is going to create a nice base using the garlic puree to add a good flavor. Top it with mozzarella, arugula, and fresh tomatoes. We're still in fresh tomato season. You want to incorporate in season veggies. And look at the beautiful colors. Season with oregano, salt, and pepper. We can put them in the oven at 400 degrees and they'll be ready in just a few minutes. Perfect. Pizza time with Alessi. In 10 to 13 minutes, your finished pizza will have crisp edges and bubbling cheese. Lots of bubbling action happening. We love that. You can pair the flatbread with a salad. Then you have a full meal. I can't wait to try it. Next up, we are using the ultra popular cauliflower to replace the wheat in our dough. A lot of people have been doing that to replace things like rice and bread just to get that low carb option. We're reinventing pizza crust in a whole new way. Mix a finely chopped head of cauliflower with mozzarella, parmigiana, and Alessi dipping spices. It takes the guesswork out of which spices do I use. These are really a blend of all Italian spices. Stir in two eggs. And the eggs are going to help hold everything together. Then form your crust. So you want to make them as thin as possible. Yeah, I think kids would really appreciate doing this. Anytime yeah. they can get their hands messy, right. they're happy. Bake the crusts in a 400 degree oven for 20 minutes. So it like, gets nice and crispy. Top the pies with marinara, fresh mozzarella, mushrooms, and tomatoes. Go ahead and use the dipping spices again to add a little bit more flavor. Then bake for another 15 minutes. Here you go, fresh out of the oven. Finish it with Alessi's balsamic reduction sauce. To help enhance the flavor even a little bit more, especially with that fresh mozzarella, basil, and tomato, it would work for anybody who's following a gluten-free diet or even anybody who's just looking to lower their carbohydrates and eat more vegetables. Now, if you need me to taste test it, I do not have a problem with that. Thanks to the Granary Apartments on Callow Hill Street for letting us use their beautiful kitchen. And if you'd like to try those recipes at home, just go to 6abc.com slash in the kitchen. You'll also find a chance to win a $100 gift card to Redner's Market and some free samples from Alessi Foods. We like free. We'll take it.